Hey guys, welcome back in the two dudes one you count. Welcome back. On that. It's your boys. Oh, I'm Corey. Fruit. I'm Roger. And we're playing Jeopardy. Yep. If you were here last time, this is the continuation yeah, of that so last time. Yeah, so we got time. TV characters, Charity, Harry, bookends. God you can damn quote it, me on Robert. that. Fruit. In Charity. 1971, this Beatle headlined the concert for Bangladesh, rock music's first major charity There's event. There's only two it could be, right? Hmm. I don't know, dude. Those mm. are all good options. I think it's John Lennon. Incorrect. Well, dude, there's only one it could be. I don't know. George Harrison could have done it before he. No, dude, it's not George Harrison, dude. He could have done it before he died. Yes, correct. Yeah. Well, son of a bitch. <laughs> son of a Player bitch. Three, please select a How category. How was I even supposed to know he was dead? John Lennon died before freaking. <laughs> In 47, <laughs> this branch of the U.S. military has helped collect and distribute toys for tots. That was the Salvation Army. No, it's not. You kidding me? I thought it was the Marines, dog. Let's see. Since we're playing bold, it's not called the Salvation Marines. Right. <laughs> <laughs> it's not like the Salvation two. Army is the Which army, dude. Would you, like? uh, you don't TV fucking characters. know. God. How did I lose so much money? Hugh Laurie that went from playing Bertie Wooster to play a cranky doctor with this last name. Come on, you bitch! It's mom. <laughs> no, it's not. You are correct. <laughs> Come on, dude. You know I. Ain't, I mean, I'm stupid, but I ain't that stupid. <laughs> oh, dude, I need some money. <laughs> yeah, you're in bad spot. Her characters include Ugly Betty and Amy, a manager at Cloud Nine Superstore. Uh, America Ferrera, baby. Precisely. I know a little bit about, maybe too much about TV and stuff, so we're going to keep clearing this category out. <laughs> Tom Selleck plays New York Police Commissioner Frank Reagan on this TV series. You know this one? I'm, I'm, I have a guess, but I'm not positive. Because there's so many police shows. You are correct. Okay, <laughs> it's too risky. I didn't know that one, for sure. Player three, please maybe select heard of that a category. Show. Oh, we're doing charity again. It was founded in 1887 to coordinate 22 Denver charities. I have no clue. Mm. <laughs> well, Robert, show us how well traveled you are. <laughs> Precisely. This is the way. This is the United Way. <laughs> this uh, is the way. Whew, Robert's killing me here. Don't mind the fezzes. Millions of dollars are raised every year by this charitable auxiliary of the Freemasons. Damn it, dude. That's the Shriners, I think. <laughs> I. Well done. Holy shit, dude, you fucking cranked in the cat, man. <laughs> Which category it's, would you like? I'd like uh, TV characters for 1600 Dude, you're jumping all over the place. Wayne Rogers played this doctor in the 4077th MASH unit. Pernell Roberts played him post-Korea. Wow, he's he's right. on it. Robert, you can have it, because I don't know. Yes, correct. Ooh, I don't Robert's know shit just, about MASH. Robert's killing it, dude. Player three? It's your turn to choose a category. Hell with you, Robert. <laughs> <laughs> According to the ancient Roman playwright, Terence, charity begins here. The heart. I, I thought it was at home. Incorrect. Motherfucking ass! God damn it! <laughs> I want to say at home. Yes. <laughs> that, that's pretty good, Player dude. Two. I got four hundred fucking dollars. <laughs> Why are you risking it so much, dude? Here you go. This your chance. Dude, that felt obvious. Rapper Ice T first played the detective known as Finn on this Law and Order spinoff. All right, I'm getting it. Um, it's Special Victims Unit. It's got to be right. That's right. Nice, dude. There's two, two thousand. Did you know that one? I. <laughs> that was you my didn't guess. Throw me a bone, did you? No. Which category would you like? Observe the following fruit. image. The name of the fruit seen here is derived from the Moroccan port city. What is an orange? Mandarin. Oh. <laughs> Tangerine? That's, that was my guess. That's it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right, dude, you're moving back up. Just gonna clear out these two thousands right here. Why would you start at two thousand on all of them? You gotta get your you get your legs. You gotta get your hairy. The following image. The hairy dog okay, seen I here belongs one. to this American Kennel Club group. Uh, 
It's a hound. That's a hound? Yeah. Precisely. It's an Afghan. Okay. Man, I don't know nothing about animals. I hate when I see animals pop up because I'm like, shit. <laughs> I don't okay. stand a chance. Um, you can quote me on that for 2000. All right. The British physicist has been quoted as saying, my goal is simple. It's a complete understanding of the universe. I'm thinking Stephen Hawking. That was my gut feeling. I'm going to go with it. I think it's Sagan. That's it. Damn it. You're good. How is that supposed to know he's British? <laughs> I never met the guy. Please select a category. Uh, let's stick with it. It's oh, a fuck. daily double. I hate it, dude. It's too stressful. Are you gonna make it a true daily double? Hell no. <laughs> let's do. Let's make it two thousand. See, see oh, where that come gets on, me. You fucking wussy, dude. At least do five. No. The author concluded a 1936 novel with the the line, "After all, tomorrow is another day." I'm glad I didn't bet that much. <laughs> Freaking coward. I don't know, dude. I'm coming after well you, you coward. Ooh, I got it. I like the alliteration of Margaret Mitchell. That's the only reason I went for that. Okay. Come on. Son of a bitch! Daily double. Dude, don't be a freaking coward, man. This is How this is an easy one. Wager? Here you go. If I bet 4,000, I'll break even. <laughs> five, dude. Do five, you coward. Nope. At her inquest, this woman who inspired a rhyme said, I knew there was an old axe down cellar. That is all I knew. I have no freaking clue. But I like, uh, you know what? Ma Barker sounds good. <laughs> Sorry, but that's okay. incorrect. Lizzie Borden has to be. I thought Mary Surratt was my other guess, but damn, I would have been wrong twice. <laughs> Dang, dude, why couldn't I got that, dude? And you took both of the, you took both of the Daily Douglas, man. Good. In 1901, he advised, speak softly and carry a big stick. You will go far. Uh, Roosevelt. You are correct. There you go, dude. Yeah, I knew it was the president. Um, Player one, pick a category. I don't remember what his nickname was, in like old big stick or something. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's what they used to call me. In but. this Norton Jester novel, uh, Milo wants to drive his car through the title entry, but it's gone before others need it. Gone like the wind. <laughs> Sadly, that's not it. Nah, it's not the hello goodbye window. Oh, damn, dude. Should I go for it? It's your call, dude. I'm too nervous. <laughs> the Phantom Toll Booth. I would go with the time tunnel. That's it. But you were right, dude. Yes. Baby, I'm back on the board. Yeah, dude. You're moving up. You're right next to me now. I'm getting nervous. Fruit. Thought of as a vegetable, this flowering plant in the nightshade family, Solanum Lacospirium, is scientifically a fruit. Correct. I thought it was too obvious. I was like, I can't Ooh. do it. It's too, it's too obvious. No, dude, that's what you get for taking all them daily duggles from me. I didn't want them in the first place. I'm sorry. Good. I didn't know. This melon has a smooth white rind and sweet green flesh. Mm. It's a watermelon. It's a watermelon. Don't be a coward. Pick watermelon. You're making me nervous, dude. You now I don't know. Correct. <laughs> Player two. You were getting in my head Which for a second there because now I'm really up, nervous. Dude. The ancient hybrid is an important economic product of Florida and California. Hmm. Oh, shit. <laughs> uh, the Florida orange. You are right. That's what I would have picked too. Whew. You just got to deduce. <laughs> Deduce the juice or fruit. The citrus comes in yellowish green and key in greener Persian types. God damn it! I wanted it so bad. That's right. Ooh. Shit! I was I was my I was gonna pick that, but it's too Player late now. One. Please select a category. Robert's over there taking a damn nap. Harry. This hairy bovine hails from the Himalayas. So yeah, <laughs> I don't know, dude. Correct. Oh, thank God. <laughs> uh, I tried. Player two, I tried for it, and you category. fucking boo booed me, dude. I, I had to. In her November 2016 concession speech, she said, "This is not the outcome we wanted." Damn it! <sighs> yes. Damn it! <laughs> yes. Correct. Oh. Oh. Player one. 
It's, it's getting tense in here, dude. It's in the air. There's tenseness in the air. <laughs> there are bird eating and trapdoor varieties in this hairy spider family. What is Rotantula? <laughs> That's right. All right, looks like we're getting close, dude. We're gonna be nurk and nurk. <laughs> yeah, dude. <laughs> Shit. I don't like being this close. The gum Gymner, a small mammal whose relatives include the moon rat and the video game character Sonic, is also called a hairy this animal. Dude, how did you get that so quick? Because I saw Sonic, dude. Hell. I was moving with the quickness. Yeah, but I clicked Sonic. that button so fast. <laughs> I think it's like it senses Player your two. desperation. <laughs> hairy legged bats are one of the three species of these blood eating bats. I'm stressed can out. You, can you hear me? Can you feel? Can you feel, feel my stress? Pick a oh God! Freaking books. Here you go, Robert. They found a splendid portrait of their master, him, in all the wonder of his exquisite youth and beauty. I don't know the Mormons. <laughs> <laughs> yes, correct. Okay. Cool. Player three. Which category would you 800, like? Robert, you just gotta move the board. He wrote, it is not often someone comes along who is a true friend and a good writer. Charlotte was both. Her web. Just let, I'm just letting Robert take all these. Please get them all right. That's not what we were going for. I don't know, dude. I'm gonna take it, dude. Um, E.B. White. Yeah, I think you're right. Damn it. Well done. Okay, dude. The uh, red puts us right on. Right, even. One. Uh, I hate select it. Select a category. Here it goes. The last paragraph of this 1908 novel mentions the gallant water rat and the famous Mr. Mole. I'll freaking know, man. A great mouse detective. <laughs> I'm not a rat. Correct. I'm glad Robert was right. I can't stand it. Last clue. This Twain hero is going to the territory because he doesn't want Aunt Sally to civilize him. Uh, Huckleberry Fit. No. Oh, God. Tom Sawyer? <laughs> Puddinghead Wilson. Tom Sawyer. Wrong. <laughs> oh. If, you know what? I'm going to guess because this will either make me a head or put us back even. <laughs> That's it, dude. I already That's said correct. it. correct. It has to be one of the two. But both of them were kind of, you know, in Everyone my mind, the same character. I know they're probably different. Honestly, dude, I thought they were going for inward Jim, and I was not cool with that. I was like, you can't put that in this Maybe game. Maybe somebody else wrote Tom Sawyer. I don't. <laughs> How much money? I think he did. Huckleberry Ham. Please, no picking. How much money you wagering, dude? <laughs> um, what island chains? Oh, I'm not far enough ahead to do anything good. That's it. I don't care. It's too risky. I can't play it that risky. For an 1867 sale, this island group was known as the Catherine Archipelago. Precisely. Uh-oh. Oh, I didn't I'm pick I'm in that. trouble. <laughs> I'm in big trouble. <laughs> Sadly, that's not it. Oh my god, I'm a fucking idiot. Robert beat me because I bet too much. <laughs> damn it! I'm sorry. God damn no. it. <laughs> Shit! <laughs> I never even heard of Illusion Island. Placement. I hate you, Robert. You're the worst. <laughs> Whew. Eat shit, rough, Robert. Dude. I hate him. In third yeah. place. Nice, dude. You gotta rank up. You have unlocked a new uh, master rank. Damn, dude. I got fucking devastated. I should have voted. I sh should have bet on nothing, dude. You have I don't know if I could still won. New master I don't think I could have. Couldn't have beat Robert. He knew it. He cheated. I was counting on you Robert getting it wrong. I didn't even look at his rank. money. Man, look at all the well, stuff we unlocked, guys. Well, I killed it, but I didn't kill rank. it, and I'm, I'm very upset. I lost to Robert, so I'm not even happy. <laughs> <laughs>
Well, uh, we'll catch you guys and gals in the next one. If y'all are enjoying this, let us know and we'll play some more. Uh, if you want to see Will Fortune or anything like that, that we have access because I bought them as a package. So let us know and leave us a comment. You know, that's the best place to let us know. Yeah. Check out the links in the description. Hit Please the subscription hit the bell. subscription bell. So yeah, you're notified when we do more Yepardy. Yep. Yepardy. <laughs> I'm coming back with a Yepardy. Yep uh... <laughs> <laughs> we'll catch you guys guys next time. Mm, game, game over. over. Why the hell am I getting levels up? Because, dude. Because. <laughs>